Hey guys, Jack here with Slow Life TV. Now, joining me now, I have Lee with his beautiful ride. Now, this thing has more cosmetic options than I could poke a stick at. This thing's incredible. It is, it is his 1994 Toyota Supra. Now, Lee, tell us a little bit what's going on with the outside of this car. It's, it looks crazy, man. Thanks, yeah, cheers that, man. A lot of work's gone into it. About 11 years I've owned the car for now. So, yeah, just uh, yeah, a lot of gear going into it. Uh, done a respray, uh, gun metal, blue pill with uh, put the diamonds in there. Sea uh, West front bar. Uh, Velside side skirts, B-style rear bar, uh, and the rims, uh, Alexani. Uh, yeah, carbon fiber bonnet, uh, new like you know, new uh, headlights on the thing as well, glass, uh, LED tail lights, carbon fiber. Uh, yeah, just trying to make it all just nice and flow, and yeah, just look really good. So. so, when you have to choose between cosmetic and performance, I take it it's cosmetic all the way. Uh, yeah, I wasn't allowed to have a turbo or a V8. I was uh, naughty when I was on uh, my P-plate. So yeah, that's what actually sent it in the cosmetic direction because I wasn't allowed to do anything uh, yeah, performance-wise. So engine and uh, turbos and that wasn't allowed. So yeah, just went all that all out on that. So yeah. Now it doesn't just go around the outside. It's also all over the interior and in the boot as well. Tell us what's going on with your interior, man. That's, that's wicked. Uh, just an idea and then it started just getting out of control man one thing led to another then all of a sudden yeah just yeah just just building upon building and ideas and i knew how i wanted it to look and uh, yeah just went there found the right people and yeah got it all sorted out so. now how many snakes did you kill to get to achieve that effect <laughs> no, no snakes were harmed in the making of this vehicle all right <laughs> so yeah no all good all good um yeah lots of leather <laughs> yeah i can smell it from here actually now uh in the boot that's pretty bitching what you've got going on there, man. Four subs, is, is that a couple of amplifiers and a, a few L LED TVs and everything in there, man. LCD, what am I talking about? <laughs> LCD tellies as well, man. Yeah, yeah, no, I just, uh, yeah, really just wanted, you know, when you were watching the subs, you had something like you could get a film clip going and that way you're watching the subs, you've got a film clip going, a bit of lights around the thing, that way you could create, you know, it's a, yeah, a bit of a party thing around the car, you know, not just make it all subs or all DB or just, yeah, just uh, as a whole cosmetic, as a whole look. Yeah, just sort of get it from every angle, trying to. Mm. Now you've got a couple of strobe lights in there as well. Essentially, it's a it's a rolling nightclub. Yeah. Now speaking of a rolling nightclub, how many decibels are you pushing out right now? Uh, not too much. Got to be tuned. Got a few drums with it, but uh, one thirty five is what we're pulling at the moment. So that's it's not, not too bad. It's loud loud enough. So yeah. Now last but not least, the Toyota Supra. What made you pick this car out of any car in the universe? Uh, Oh, the, that bloody movie, <laughs> Fast and Furious. And I, it was, uh, I actually saw the car a year before that and decided that I really liked it. And then uh, that movie came out and that kind of sealed the deal. So, yeah, just, uh, just went from there, mate, and everyone got crazy and, yeah, got the import. So, yeah, it was good. good job. Well, thank you very much for joining us on Slow Life TV, Lee. It's been an absolute pleasure. I'm Jack and I'll catch you later.